The future of the commonly used abortion pill Mifepristone is up in the air. Today, the Supreme Court heard arguments that could affect access to the pill. But justices questioned the legal standing of the case. An anti-abortion rights group is accusing the FDA of unlawfully easing restrictions to Mifepristone. Lawyers for that group claim doctors saw an increase in emergency room visits treating women who took the drug. Without question, the FDA's actions have made taking chemical abortion drugs less safe. The lawyer you're about to hear from now, Jessica Ellsworth, represents the maker of Mifepristone. They fail to show under any rational legal standard why they have standing to bring this suit. The FDA says Mifepristone is safe when used as indicated and directed. The agency approved the drug nearly 25 years ago. It allows Mifepristone to be prescribed by mail, but five states, including Wisconsin, require patients to see a doctor in person to get a prescription. Wisconsin Democratic Representative Mark Pocan is saying on X he believes attempts to ban Mifepristone are, quote, part of a broader agenda to undermine and eventually ban abortion. So far, none of Wisconsin's Republican representatives have shared their thoughts on this case.